G'day viewers. Well, big news in Australia today was a street fight near Sydney's Bondi Beach. Wow, why is a street fight big news? Were there hundreds of people involved? Was it like the Cronulla race riots all over again? Were they using lots of weapons? Were they hitting each other with babies? Why do we want to talk about it? Well, we want to talk about it because the two blokes fighting were billionaire Jamie Packer and the head of Channel 9 in Australia, David Gingell. And the real weird twist, besides billionaires and TV bosses fighting, the Packer family used to own Channel 9. So this is like former boss employee fight. You know, Kerry Packer, Jamie's dad, uh, used to own it when Kim Gingell, David Gingell's father, was there. So maybe this goes back generations. Maybe this was, what did you say about my mum? And my dad fucked your mum. I'm not saying that's what happened, but I am saying that's what happened. It was hilarious. The first person who posted it, because it happened outside his house, he's on Twitter going, oh my god, there was this fight. And it was Jamie Bloody Packer with some other angry dude, because David Gingell's not that well known, but once the pictures got out, it's like, oh wow, that's a bit of a story. And when I say pictures got out, the rumour is the News Corp paid about $200,000 for the pictures somebody took and then they thought we must protect our exclusive and they published them with this bizarre covering of watermarks and almost straight away on Australian social media the story became the ridiculous fucking watermarks rather than the punch up. It's like they've gone, yeah look at that, now no one can use it including us because it looks like shit. Maybe it's a picture of Jamie Packer fighting it's our fucking name there a hundred times. Yeah, go away. I'm not owned by you, okay? But, yeah, it's just absolutely bizarre. And, of course, anyone with half a brain knows, although that looks like it's got to stop someone, within an hour on Twitter, I saw a photo published where someone had used Photoshop to get rid of it. I mean, it's a fucking joke. These people are idiots. They just made themselves look like dicks. I have no idea what Packer and Ginger were fighting over, but they made themselves look like idiots. Uh, News Corp made themselves look like idiots. Oh, and then there was a very terse press release put out uh, by the parties later saying, you know, we're still friends, uh, respect our privacy type of thing. Fuck you in the neck, you fucking fucks. These people with their tabloid bullshit News have made millions out of exploiting and humiliating people who don't fucking deserve it, okay? And I regularly say, hey, why is the media covering that story on Wanger Fat Wednesday? Bidding up, no, actually, if you think this is not a story, maybe billionaires and media heads fight in your street every fucking day. But also, the idea of respect their privacy, fuck you guys, you're scum and... Having a laugh at your expense is the best thing that happened to me so far this week. Now that's the news and that's the truth.